Hey, attention crypto gossipators, things are about to get interesting. Remember, not financial advice. Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. So guys, what we are seeing here with Bone is a lot of red. Now, some people are going to panic. Others are going to bend down, get on their knees and just thank the crypto God for creating this situation where we could actually load up and take a bone so cheap one last time before it completely all changes because we know that we have the Bitcoin halving 14 days away, right? Exciting, exciting times, exciting days ahead of us. So much is expected to happen. Now, are we ready for this? A lot of us are still unsure, right? You're thinking, well, do I have enough bone? Do I not have enough bone? Bone, the gas token, the most important, you know, um, thing on Shibarium. As you know, the layer two solution has gained a lot of attention, a lot of traction. TVL has gone up. So everything is increasing. Now, the big question a lot of people are just looking at, at their bags and saying, well, is this enough? Is this enough? Because we all know we're going to start breaking resistance lines. This is the lowest point we are going to see. And a lot of people just want to know, well, do I have enough to feel satisfied? Because the worst feeling you could have is just not being able to, you know, fulfill the full potential. Now, I know a lot of you are very diversified in, in regards to your portfolios. You're not just uh, holding in bone, which is good. You know, you got to diversify your risk. But at the same time, is Bone going to be one of your big, big, you know, poker cards out there that is going to blossom and, and turn you into a very wealthy person? Well, depends how much you hold. Now, you know, as people are freaking out about this price, you know, I've, I've really given up on this uh, whole idea of me just panicking and be like, oh, okay, yeah, it's so difficult. So, oh my God, the price is down. That's it. It's dead. Come on. I've already seen it millions and millions of times, been covering Bone for like two years. It's all the same type of panic. I ignore it, but I am seeing less of it, right? Because the sentiment is increasing. People know the full potential of Bone. People understand what Bone can do. Now, if you look at the comment uh, section right here in Coin Market Cap, it's very bullish. Bullish. First one says, having the opportunity. I missed buying Bitcoin 2017, SHIB in 2020, uh, FET last year. This time I already learned a research and I'll be patient. I don't crazy miss Bone, right? So people don't want to miss out Bone on this big pump. Now, as you know, we've got Bitcoin halving. That is going to have an effect on a lot of the altcoins and stuff, but it's not the big, big, you know, season. The big season is the altcoin season itself when all that money from Bitcoin starts pouring into the cryptos. That's where the real money is made, right? The big buck. Now, uh, someone else says $100, just $23 billion market cap. So effing easy. Obviously, we're going to have a bit of a bearish uh, sentiment here, but let's see if I can actually see what it is. Bone, not possible Binance listing because top four ranking to going 10 rank or loser. This doesn't even make sense. Guys, put Binance is coming up. I don't know what this person is on about. Um, now, We've got more stuff, guys. Um, this is a support level that we need to break upwards. If we don't, we go mid-60s. So, of course, you know, this is all support levels, all technical analysis. But we know that the big stuff, the big news is coming very soon. The capital is going to be flowing. Bitcoin is going to be moving all the cryptos. I think there's so much room for bone to grow, right? People are also predicting. Look, look at how much green there is, right? There's a lot of green here. I mean, look at this comment section. This wasn't the case before. It's just people just start, you know, really understanding how cryptos work. And a lot of those that are holding bone are really sophisticated investors. They're not just investors that invest, invest based on charts. I mean, based on charts, we don't really have much to show off. Yeah, once we went over $3, but that's nothing, really. It's nothing. Now, Shiba Inu does have a lot. So that's the big comparison. That's why a lot of people go into Shiba Inu because of its past performance. But what we have is a great, great future. With such a small circulating supply, everything is possible. Massive upside right? Bone, we want bo uh, bone, get it here. Kusama, let, let's get bone. 
right? Bone soon launch on Binance, hit over $100. Bone, how much bone you are holding, guys. So a lot of like, you know, bullishness here. Yeah, you can see what the occasional red, but look at this. This looks like it crashed and died. I'd pull out and look into Doge. Big fudder. I mean, what, what died what? What has died? We have seen dips and peaks all the time here, right? It's been always going in waves. So what we have right now is just genuine, sophisticated, very intelligent investors. You know, those that go beyond share that did a lot of research, they're in bone, right? They understand that bone still has a lot of things to go through, like the big listings, ShibaSwap 2.0, some big projects to go on Shibarium. I think once we connect all these dots, it is going to be beautiful. So again, look at the price, realize, you know, are you prepared to uh, just say, well, okay, my, my bag is, is enough and this wouldn't suit my bag. Or do I want to load it up a little bit more? So you make the choices, right? Because the bullishness is there. You know, I'm scrolling with these comments. It's, it's insane. Everyone is bullish. Everyone is excited. And 14 days are left. We might have a Shiba Swap 2.0 in the meantime. We might get a big listing. Anything is possible. That's the thing with cryptos. You know, you wake up and your life changes. Why not, right? So comment down below how you guys are feeling. What are you doing? Where are you at? This is kind of like just a little update with what's going on because, you know, I don't want to get people too uh, worried about the price. I mean, come on, give me a break. This should be a blessing for you. You know, this is a big opportunity right before the big moment. It's like, you know, this is f free ammunition, put it this way, to load up your gun and start using it properly, right? When we go in the bull run, it's going to become messy, messy, and you're going to be making the most out of it, right? So subscribe, turn that notifications bell on, engage, like, share, all that great stuff matters. And as usual, guys, a big thank you to everyone. I appreciate all the support, and I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.